YouTube, what's going on today? Today, we have a really cool video for you guys. As you can see here, I have some boxes of Panini football cards. Now, I've been wanting to collect cards for a while. I did collect cards for um, like a couple years ago and then I stopped. But now, you know, I'm collecting again as card prices are raising. You know, I probably could have sold these for um, more than I paid for, but you know, it's whatever. Um, but yeah, so we got three boxes for you guys. We got two, two of these, and then one of this, which has 30 cards per box, and these both have 40. Now today we're gonna be looking for some rookies like Herbert, uh, Tua, Jalen Hurts, Jonathan Taylor. I I don't think Jonathan Taylor will go for a lot, but like, you know, some of those big ones like Jerry Judy too, who have a very high potential, and Herbert and Justin Jefferson are rookie of the year debating you know we don't know who's winning personally i think it's going to be herbert because everybody's qb biased but it is what it is so yeah let's get into the pack opening and yeah look at this you gotta open the box crisply don't worry. oh it looks like it was already banged up when i bought it though uh so you see this is one box right here we got five five packs uh what is this there is eight cards in each pack let's try to pull some heat okay so first pack here don't worry i'll show you guys who we get but okay so first one is this season ticket game 23 Looks like a Juju Smith Schuster. Here, I will put up like that. We got Juju. Looks like the same type of card here for Sony Michelle. Are these all season tickets? No. Okay. Maybe. We got the same for Larry Fitzgerald. Are these numbered? No. Okay. We got a Austin Eckler. A Jimmy Garoppolo. A Khalil Mack. Oh. A Michael Thomas. And then we got a round one numbers. Justin Jefferson. Joe Burrow card. This is is this is not numbered so looks like no heat out of this pack looks like we got the same for adam thielen travis kelsey deshaun watson russell wilson ryan Tannehill, marvin jones jr Richard Sherman, and then we have a winner's ticket, Michael Thomas, as it is not numbered either. No heat so far. Um, I don't know about the packs, though, because I thought they would be different, but they're not the Panini Prism Break, so those ones are really expensive. These ones are cheap from Target. We have a Baker Mayfield, a DeAndre Hopkins. So we're getting some good players, but no extremely good pulls. We have the now retired man, Philip Rivers, in a Colts uni. We have Roquan Smith, Alvin Kamara. Um, who's this? Todd Gurley. Jalen Ramsey, and then we have an MVP contenders, Kurt Cousins. Is this one numbered? It is not numbered. I don't know if we're going to get anything good that is numbered, and then we just got a Super Bowl reporter thing. But, so... Yeah. 
pack number four of five right here. We're starting off with Big Ben. Whoops. Then we got Mr. Broken Ankle, Dak Prescott. We have Jason Witten, who just retired and is now coaching at a college, I think it was Texas. We have Teddy Bridgewater. We have TB12, the GOAT. We have Drew Locke. We have, who is this? Tredavious White card. And then we have a Rookie of the Year, Jacob Eason. Is this one numbered? It doesn't look like any of these are numbered at all. But this is kind of a cool card, I'm not going to lie. We will, even though it's not numbered, we'll put it in a nice sleeve. Um, let's see. Got Jacob Eason. We'll look. On to the final pack now of our um, first box. Okay, so... Our first card is a Dalvin Cook. We have a Tyree Kill. Oh, I didn't show you the card. Sorry about that. Tyree Kill. JJ Watt. You know, I don't think he'll be a Texan next year. We have Josh Allen, the Jaguars defensive end, not the Bills quarterback. We have Terry Scary McLaurin. Matthew Stafford, who is now a Ram, actually. Oh, oh, we got a big one. We'll save this one for last. We have a Randy Moss a Legendary. Is this is this numbered? This is not numbered, but it's a pretty cool card. It is a legendary contenders. And then we have a rookie ticket, Lavaris Chenault, with a patch. This is not numbered either, but it is rookie card. Pretty cool with a little patch right there. Yeah, we are definitely going to sleeve this one, especially with Trevor Lawrence on the way. This could be a card to keep. Now that we are through our first box here, let's look at our best pulls other than all the regular ones. We have an MVP, Kirk Cousins, or MVP Contenders. I don't think he's ever been in the MVP conversation. We have a Michael Thomas winner's ticket, which I just dropped. God, got those butterfingers. We have a Joe Burrow Justin Jefferson first round rookie edition card, I guess. We have a legendary contenders, Randy Moss. We have a Jacob Eason, rookie of the year one. And then probably our best poll. I wish this was an auto. The LaViscus Chenault rookie card with the patch. I'm definitely going to keep this one. But yeah, let's get into the second box. Okay, we got five packs now here for the second box. I'll do a better job of showing you guys the card more. I don't think I was doing a good job on the first box. That is my fault. But we'll do a better job this second time around. Okay, so here's our first pack. I'm not looking at any of the cards. And we'll just throw that down there. Okay, so... Our first one is a Jason Witten Raiders card. Another Teddy Bridgewater. Looks like most of these are duplicates from our next one, which is a Dalvin Cook. Then a, whoops, don't want to drop it. A Tyree Kill. A Tom Brady TB12. A... God, I am so clumsy today. A Drew Locke. A Tredavious White. And then a Jordan Love and Justin Herbert 
Um, round one numbers football contenders. We will sleeve this, you know, as it's the best, pretty much the best card of the pack. Probably the one that will sell for the most. Here is the second pack now. We are ripping it open. If I can. Okay. There we go. So, we have a Darius Leonard. A James Connor. Amari Cooper. Derek Carr. A, I think that, yes, this is a Julio Jones. A Keenan Allen. And a Rob Gronkowski with a Jeff Glandy and Justin Jefferson um, round one numbers card. We will sleeve this too. I don't know if these go for anything, but we're sleeving them just in case. On to pack number three. Okay, so our first one is a CMC Christian McCaffrey. Hope he, I really hope he's healthy for next year. He is such a stud on the field. We have a Adam Thielen, a Travis Kelsey, a Melvin Gordon, Alshon Jeffrey, who also battled with injuries all year, a DJ Chark, a Ryan Tannehill, and then we have a winner's ticket player, Aaron Rodgers, who is the MVP of this season. We will sleeve this. To be clear, we're talking about the 2020-2021 season, you know. When it's the Chiefs Bucks in the Super Bowl, Brady versus Mahomes. Cool. On to pack number four now. Okay, we have for pack number four, we have a Deshaun Watson, a Russell Wilson, a Baker Mayfield, who did have a terrific season, by the way. A DeAndre Hopkins. Oh, whoops. A Marvin Jones Jr. A Richard Sherman. Roquan Smith. And then an MVP contenders, Buccaneers, Tom Brady. So leave it. This is our final pack of box number two. Cool. So we have a Philip Rivers, a Big Ben Roethlisberger, a Dak Prescott, an Alvin Kamara, Todd Gurley, Jalen Ramsey. Oh, we got something big. I'll save this for later. Oh, we got a legendary contenders, Emmett Smith. We're definitely about to sleeve that. And then we have a Gabriel Davis rookie ticket card, just like the LaVisca Chenault we just got. This card looks nice. He is going to be a stud, especially with Josh Allen as his quarterback. That's for sure. Okay, now, so box two is done. Let's go over what our highlighted cards are. So our highlighted cards will start from the front to the back, I guess. We'll go this Justin Herbert, Jordan Love with the Justin Jefferson and Jeff Glandy. Pretty much the same card. Then we have this winner's ticket, Aaron Rodgers. This MVP contenders, Tom Brady, a legendary contenders, Emmett Smith, and then this rookie ticket, Gabriel Davis.
and I'm definitely going to save this one along with the LaVisca Chanel, as he will be a stud alongside Stefan Diggs and Josh Allen. That offense is high-powered. You could see him probably break out next year. I suggest as a fantasy sleeper next year, that's for sure. Now on to our third and final box. This one does only have 30 cards in it, but who cares? Now we are on to our third and final box here. And yeah, let's just get into these cards. Let me open this without like ripping it open, you know? Okay, so it looks like this box just only comes with 30 cards straight. Um, yeah, so we'll just go through them one by one and see if we pull some heat. Kind of sucks though having it like that, you know? You know, I liked physically having to rip open the pack. Very disappointing, but let's get through it. So we have an Alshon Jeffrey, DJ Chark, Ryan Tannehill, Marvin Jones Jr., Richard Sherman, Roquan Smith, Alvin Kamara. A Cam Newton, Kyler Murray, Hale Murray, should I say, a Joey Bosa, a Chris Godwin, a Cortland Sutton, a Miles Sanders, Joe Mixon, Super Bowl MVP Julian Edelman. Oh, and then we have a legendary contenders, Dan Marino. We'll sleeve this with a rookie of the year, Michael Pittman Jr. He looked like a stud. He's 6'4", has good hands, can catch, or not can catch the ball, can run really well, and he can catch the ball, of course, but he looks really good. We'll sleeve that too. Then we have a Lynn ba Baldwin Jr. with a Brian Edwards. A winner's ticket, Patrick Mahomes. And then who is this? <laughs> I personally love this man. I know the media loves this man. We have an MVP contenders, Gardner Minshew. Let's go. Damn. Then we, have, we already have this one, but a legendary Emmett Smith, a Jordan Love and Justin Herbert. Oh, the, now the Detroit Lion and MVP contenders, Jared Goff. Whew. A rookie of the year, T Higgins. This looks sexy. I'm not gonna lie, this card art, that looks really nice. And, he, and along with Joe Burrow, he's he's going to be a stud from years to come. We'll put that on top of Michael Pittman. Oh, my God. We have an MVP contenders, Aaron Donald. Look at this, man. One of the greatest defensive players of our time. Actually, the greatest defensive player of all time. That's a lot to say, but... We have a Rookie of the Year, Denzel Mims. Now, he's on the Jets, so we don't know how good he'll actually be, but we'll figure it out. A Chase Claypool and Cole Komet card. A Winner's Ticket, Cam Newton. And MVP contenders, Drew Brees, may he, have, may he have a great retirement, man. Such a career. And for our final card, a rookie of the year, he's in Jacksonville, James Robinson, the undrafted rookie stud. This man is such a beast. So, yeah, that pack definitely had some heat. I guess it makes up for not having us rip it, but... Yeah, that, that was definitely worth it. But let's go over all of these cards here that we just got from our third box, which 
are pretty much the good cards on the base cards but they're kind of the base cards because they're in like every pack but we'll, let's still go over them i still haven't sleeved them yet so it's pretty much we're just running through it again for our winners we have a winner's ticket cam newton winner's ticket patrick mahomes i don't know if this will be good but hopefully it is we have a rookie of the year james robinson rookie of the year denzel mims a rookie of the year t higgins and a rookie of the year michael pittman jr we have a legendary dan marino a uh Lynn Bowden Jr. and Brian Edwards. And then we have Garner Minshew, Minshew Mania, baby, MVP card. Then we have a legendary Emmett Smith. We already pulled this one. We have a Chase Claypool and Cole Komet, along with a Jordan Love and Justin Herbert. We already have that one, too. Then we have a MVP contenders, Drew Brees, MVP contenders, Jared Goff, and MVP contenders, Aaron Donald. So overall, this was a good first pack opening for me as these boxes weren't very expensive. We are still looking for our first autograph though, but you know, it's our first box break. Um, we'll have more down the line to come, but um, yeah, I, I definitely think we had some good pulls. Don't know any of the prices, not even going to tell you guys what it is. Not going to tell you guys how much these are or anything, you know, but you know, you're looking for those cards that you can hold on to. And so if they... Are playing really good at a time you know you can sell them high and actually make money to help you better in life you know if you pull like a like a 30 dollar box and then you get like a 900 dollar card that you could save or something and they go to the hall of fame or something you have the rookie card like patrick mahomes but potentially you could sell one of his one of patrick mahomes car rookie cards just sold for what it was like 830k or something like that like god damn holy crap you know but for our two like outstanding cards, we have this um, rookie ticket LaVisca Chenault and this rookie ticket Gabriel Davis. Now this was definitely a pleasure to make this video for you guys. I definitely enjoy opening these packs and having these cards there. They're really fun. Hopefully down the line we can get more of the expensive packs and all and we can hopefully pull autographs out of that. You know, that would be so nice and pull these rookie QBs or something or maybe even next year pull like a Trevor Lawrence or a Justin Fields or like a Devontae Smith. Who knows? But yeah, Th thank you guys for watching. This was really fun to make and remember our best two pulls was this Gabriel Davis rookie card and this Lavoska Chanel rookie card, both rookie tickets with patches. But yeah. Uh, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, and ring that notification bell so you know when all my videos go live. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Take care and peace.